We're joined once again by Ms. Charlene Patton with the Kansas Soybean Commission, and this is a special month because... It's National Soy Foods Month. It is, <laughs> and so what are we making because the ingredients look amazing. Oh, this is a wonderful salad recipe. Um, the Kansas Soybean Commission is featuring all kinds of recipes that use different soy food ingredients since mm. it's Soy Foods Month. We're going to start out with quinoa here. Okay. Okay. And I made um, cooked this ahead of time, mm -hmm. cooled it, so it's three cups of cooked quinoa. And then to this, we're going to add a soy ingredient, and that is our edamame. Okay. And I've already cooked it too, so it's ready to go. And you are going to add, look at these blueberries. I know, I love blueberries. They're my favorite. I love this because it just gives a pop of sweetness in each bite in this wonderful salad. And then this is one cucumber. Okay. You are going to add that, that I've just skip peeled it and then quartered it. Okay. You have red onion. Mm -hmm. It's going to mm -hmm. add another flavor here. And then, Jared, your next ingredient yes. is basil. Okay. And right now, uh, since a maybe a little early if we don't have all of our herbs out yet, but I did find a package of chopped basil in the fresh herbs section, and oh, that's okay. what I got and made it very easy. Then you have fresh mint there. Ooh. So one, I think, uh, one-fourth cup there of the fresh mint. And then I made the dressing ahead of time. And oh, good. And it's easy. Just put it in a little container and... Uh, shake it, but go ahead and add that. That is fresh lemon juice, fresh uh, lemon zest, some vegetable oil, and a little bit of Dijon mustard. Now look at that. It Doesn't that look it wonderful? So many pops of color too. And when you said you just fresh all those herbs, the lemon, it just, mm -hmm. you're right, makes it very fresh. Then we put this here and then right before you serve it, Mm -hmm. uh, put some fresh avocado on it oh. and makes just yes. a great and you nice know touch. this will serve 12 make 12 servings oh, wow. so okay. it makes a nice salad for a, a group or if you're going somewhere and then I want to mention the new booklet yes. because it's National Soy Foods Month this is an opportunity that you can get this wonderful free booklet it has this recipe in it but it also has all the latest health and nutrition information of oh, why good. we need soy in our diet and then it has a glossary of what is edamame, you mm -hmm. know, just to help yeah. uh, consumers relate to all of our soy ingredients that we have. So how do people get it and where do they go for more information? They should go to kansassoybeans.org or they can call our 800 number 877-KS-Soybean. All right, Ms. Charlene Patton, thank you so much. Always a pleasure. Thank you. Stay with us. We're back right after this.